Something's playing with it. I got him, boys. We're on. What is up, gang? Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, can't wait for this little video I want to put out. Uh, I got a little surprise for you guys. It's going to be a video of us first. First of all, we're going to tie on uh, a little bit of some mealworms. Yes, mealworms. They're asleep right now. They're waking up. Going to put it on this little pole right here and take you guys along with the ride of catching some bluegill or whatever we can tilapia and hopefully getting them in here in the live well so later we can go out and catch some flatheads on the Alamo River. I uh, haven't put a video out in a couple weeks, so excited to, to, to do some fishing. Hopefully be able to catch some bait, put it in the live well, take it out to the Alamo, and catch some flathead before it gets too dark. Want to do a little bit of some uh, afternoon fishing so that we can catch some good footage, because at night it's kind of hard because it's really dark. So, I can't wait. Got uh, some mealworms, like I said, and we got some power light tubes and I got some other little uh, panfish jigs to throw on and hopefully hit some spots up. This spot a while ago, like two or three weeks ago was full of water, got a bunch of bait out of here, but today it's a little low. So might be a little mission. Might have to drive it out to a couple more places and uh, hopefully get some bluegill because uh, that's what the bass, that's what the flathead like. I uh, haven't been doing too much bass fishing. It's been super hot during the day. Weather's been crazy. But at night it's cool and uh, I've been uh, I've been ever since I went out with um, my buddy Jesse from Woody's Vibes I've been like hooked on this flathead fishing thing so uh, I want to go out there and show you guys a process about how we do it we don't got the boat uh, Jesse's out doing his own thing on his boat but we're just gonna do some bank fishing along the Alamo and I want to take you guys along for the ride so stay tuned I'm gonna put you guys on the chesty catch a couple of these bluegill hopefully Get them in the aerator, get them all nice and comfortable, and then go out to the Alamo and catch some flathead. You guys stay tuned. Peace. All right, you guys, we got some little mealworms right here. You can see them. Got them at a uh, little grocery store here in Hopeville. These guys are barely kind of waking up and getting around. So we're just going to put one of these on this hook with the bobber. Which you guys you can see. Nothing special. Just get them on there. Get them rigged up. The bluegill love them. And it's super easy. If there's something here, it's super easy. I see some movement of the water. And let me get this chain for you guys so you can see. It's kind of down there. We're just going to let this guy sit. And hopefully. Oh, we got we already got, we already got something biting. I might have already lost my bait. Might have already lost the bait. I was getting the GoPro adjusted so you guys can actually see. Let's check our bait. Yep, he got our bait. So let's retie. Come over here. They love these mealworms. So let's see. Be a little faster next time. Let's see. Get this guy. Rigged up right here again. Uh oh, oh no! Let's get him like this. Okay, oh my gosh. I'm destroying this guy. Let's see if that will do. I'll probably pull it off. I'll try this. I only want a couple. I only need a couple. All right, we gotta go. Our light's getting... We can go down the road a little bit. I know there's a spot that don't work. I don't know what we're gonna do, guys. Could you guys back? Okay, second spot, there's a lot of water here. And so we're gonna throw our line in down there. 
hopefully get some bait in the light well. Come on, baby. Let's see. I'm just gonna go with the live worms because it seems to be what was good enough last the first time. Last time. Super good. Just throwing them. A little bit of drag. A lot more water in this one, so hopefully. There we go. There we go. Got one. Got one, guys. Woo! I don't even care how big it is. All I, all I know, all I want is a bluegill. So that's what we got. Little baby. Okay, now that we got this guy, we're going to put him over here and let him chill. And put some water in this five gallon bucket so that we can keep him alive. Hopefully I don't fall in uh, by getting some water in this. We, we don't need a lot. Just need enough so that he won't die. Okay, that should be good. Alright, we got water. Okay. Now, got water. Let's get this hook out. Let's put him in there. Let's get this aerator going to keep him alive. Boom. Nice little lid. in there he should be good to go see he's in there okay let's go get some more okay okay I gotta let that thing go down I just gotta let that thing go down just gotta be patient there we go got one got one guys okay oh it's like a baby though oh it's a little too small we're gonna keep him just in case it's like dory size right there. We want we want a mondo. They want the mealworms. Oh, there we go. That's what we want, baby. That's what we want right there. The bite is on. The little kager. That's what we want right there. That size is perfect. Perfect size right there. Perfect size. Let's see how much more we can get. You might have just told her, but nope, we got it. Okay, that's right, baby. Okay. There. That'll do. That will do. That's one that we want. Okay. I mean, I wish they could be a little bigger. We're not going to get too picky. We're going to call that a day. And then we're going to go back to the house. I got to get some stuff rigged up for tonight. We're going to go get some flathead. Okay. okay, guys. We're here at this little spot out here in Hopeville. Got my little bluegill. Just going to get the little area set up so we can put a line in. Hopefully. Catch one of these jungle cats. Catch one of these Alamo jungle cats. We'll see how it goes. Haven't had that great a look, but we're gonna try to get one. All right, now let's get this fish on. Set up already. Four ounce weight. Current's kind of strong right here. Thing for over there. Okay, one, two. Hopefully that'll be good.
Something's playing with it. I got him, boys. We're on. We got him. Ain't a big one. That guys, look at that guy. Heck yeah, got him. See that guys? Oh god, guys, he got him. Oh yeah, he's fighting. See that? Yeah, we got one. Let's tie him out. Get a good look at him. Yeah, see that? Right there. Trying to tire him out a little bit. Let's pull him up here. Got one, boys. The last fish barely hooked in. Now this guy's been beat up before. This wasn't me. Look at that. Mm. Nice one. Okay, let's let him go. All right, you guys kind of missed it because I had the GoPro off. Threw the bluegill out. Different little spot. And here he is. We got ourselves one right here. Not that big. All right, little size, but we'll take him. Got the standard for the size I've been getting on this part of the Alamo right here. See this guy? Chilling side of the side of the mouth. Barely got him. Not that big, kind of average size. So we're gonna get him and put him back right now. Take out the hook, his mouth, and now we're going home. Pack it up and bounce. Peace.